About a year ago, we told you how former Newswatch 16 reporter Alan Vickers was diagnosed with kidney disease and in need of a transplant. A lot of you have been asking about Alan. With the holiday season approaching, our Nikki Cries checked in with our old friend today. Alan Vickers was a reporter at Newswatch 16 for three years and was a favorite of our viewers. I left Scranton in 2019, but still having people reach out and like remember me is incredible. Alan now lives and works in Philadelphia. One year ago, he opened up about some very personal health news. Alan has kidney disease and needs a transplant. Alan is not only a former co-worker, he is a friend, so we wanted to see how he is doing one year later. He says he feels like he has an invincible disease. Like I'm able to work, I'm able to walk around, walk my dog, um, do things, but at the end of the day, there is still, I'm dealing with a chronic kidney disease. And um, that disease, it affects, you know, me mentally and physically. Last year, Allen was put on the kidney transplant list at Jefferson Health in Philadelphia. He was told it could take six to eight years to get a kidney. But if Allen finds a living donor, it could take less than two months. Allen's blood type is O positive, so he would need a donor who is either O positive or O negative. The 32 year old is feeling good right now, but knows the reality of his condition. It could go left at any point, And, um, so I definitely make sure that I'm always exercising. I have to take my medicine daily, um, sometimes twice a day, sometimes three times a day. Right now, Alan has weekly doctor's appointments to manage his kidney disease. Lots of tests, um, lots of procedures. I think I've had four procedures uh, related um, to my medical condition over the past, like, Five months. Alan's Christmas wish is for a kidney transplant so he can close this chapter of his life. If you would like to see if you are a match, head to WNEP.com for more information. And if you aren't a match for Alan, he said maybe you could help the thousands of others awaiting a transplant. Alan says he is thankful for everyone's well wishes and he will not let this disease defeat him. Nikki Cries, Newswatch 16.